proof tonight in 7 News of Melbourne drivers who are risking their lives and the safety of others by failing to secure their loads. It's a problem that's reaching plague proportions with more than 100 tonnes of debris removed from our roads every year. Dean Felton reports. Dropping debris is dangerous enough, but the hazards multiply when drivers try to retrieve their goods. Even though three semi-trailers had crushed his ladder, this man dashed in front of CityLink traffic to get it back. In another incident, a man risked his life for a wheelie bin. There's over 4,000 incidents a year of uh, debris falling off vehicles. More than 2,000 a year on CityLink and EastLink alone. Almost always the items aren't properly tied down. Well, in the last two months, we've collected two 20,000 litre water tanks. This bin full of soil blocked an EastLink exit ramp for hours, while CityLink traffic had to swerve when a mobile crane's boom broke free. This caravan's roof wasn't made to withstand high winds, and even boats have come adrift a long way from the water. Ladders, couches, televisions, and in some cases, mattresses. There are fines if you cause an accident, up to $11,000 for individuals, $58,000 for companies. 50% of Melbourne's traffic is carried on just 3% of its road network. That's why even relatively minor disruptions can mean that large parts of the city come almost to a standstill. Well, for the commercial vehicle industry, it's, it's hundreds of thousands of dollars uh, in, in lost uh, productivity. They're urging everyone, amateurs and professionals, to take more care use a suitable vehicle and to restrain their load using straps or a cover that meet the Australian standard. To avoid potentially deadly incidents like this one overseas. <laughs> Dean Felton, 7 News.